Hi folks, this is all the fruit and today I'm here for the peach almonds. I'm in the beautiful city of Heidelberg. On the other side of the river is the famous Heidelberg Castle, maybe the most beautiful ruin in the world. And here, facing more or less to the southwest, is a Mediterranean garden protected by the air conditioning of the river and by this huge wall and the slope behind it. Well, peach almonds don't need so much protection, but here are a couple other things like pomegranates and lockwats and uh, nah, what do you call it, bitter oranges, which are grateful for that protection. What are the, uh, what are the peach almonds? Well, it's a hybrid of peach and almond, and it's been bred to produce very early, very big, very pink, and very frost resistant flowers. That's why it grows here in this area everywhere as an ornamental. But it also produces almonds which are more or less edible. However, today my main objective is to find out whether the flowers are edible. Pretty much all the flowers of our rosaceous fruit trees are edible, but the taste is very different in different species. So today we want to try out if the peach almond flowers are edible. Beautiful huge flowers. Mm. Well, the dominant taste is one of bitter almonds. It's quite funny because the fruit the seeds, which are the almonds, are actually not bitter in this hybrid. But yeah, the flowers have a mild cyanic acid bitterness, which is very nice and tasty. That's why bitter almonds are used as a condiment for a lot of sweet stuff. The second dominant taste is a sourness. So the pleasant bitterness of bitter almonds, together with the sourness is quite nice. What I don't like so much is the flowers are a bit dryish. Maybe because I also ate those, what would those be, bracts? Yeah, I guess they are bracts. The, the dark red stuff are the sepals, the pale purple are the petals. So I guess those grayish hairy things are the bracts. Okay. What if I try to adjust the petals? Petals are usually the best in a flower. Okay, I will not show them to you because the wind. A bit better, but still on the dry side. Cherry and peach flowers were a lot nicer, partially due to the juiciness. Well, since I'm here, let's try some of the peach almonds. Almonds and peach almonds can stay on the tree for many months. <coughs> <coughs> remain more or less fresh. <coughs> Here I already corrected two from a different tree. Let's try those first. And now those. <coughs> okay, <coughs> so let's see. <coughs> the first one looks intact, but the inside looks a bit discolored. No. Still totally edible. The second one, mm -hmm. they both tasted good. <coughs> the third one is rotten. The first one I broke it, but it should still be enough to try. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <coughs> the fourth one is also okay. <coughs> Final verdict, the flowers are edible, <coughs> they have a nice flavor, especially the, <coughs> the bitter almond taste is interesting, but a bit dry because of the bracts. The almonds, however, they can be eaten even in April, 75% intact almonds after hanging in the ripe state 
on the tree for about half a year is quite a good it's quite a good average of course <coughs> four elements is not enough for a statistic but at least you can see that probably the most of them will be still good so yeah honestly folks maybe rather eat some cherry flowers because uh, let's be honest who has ever managed to harvest all the cherries from a big tree or eat some pear flowers just leave one or two per or three per per bunch since they will be culled anyway and <coughs> by the tree and just one pear will be left per per bunch or per inflorescence but with the peach elements maybe take a couple ones for decoration for food but don't eat too many since the almonds are quite tasty and even after hanging on the tree or lying on the ground for half a year they're edible so not worth to destroy too many peach almond flowers better wait for the fruit <coughs> okay folks so those were the peach almonds in a on a pretty gloomy easter monday in the beautiful city of heidelberg stay tuned for a lot more fruit videos from the beautiful city of heidelberg and don't forget to like share comment and subscribe